Well, I hope that you and your family have begun the autumn term well and that everyone is settled into routines at the college. This year, we want to keep the college moving forward and developing whilst maintaining its ethos and of course its community. Our physics department would tell me that if I want to keep the college moving, I need to apply Newton's three laws of motion. And these are also applicable to our pupils' lives. Now, Newton's first law is that every object will remain at rest unless compelled to change its state by a new force. Nothing will change this year unless we apply a new force to it. Newton's first principle is that an object will remain motionless unless a force is applied to it. Now, there's an old saying that if you aren't moving forward, you are actually going backwards. I'm not sure Newton would agree with this, but there is a need to keep improving ourselves and especially to keep improving the college and keep it moving forward. So throughout the college, we'll need to put in effort or new force if we want to see change. These could be small changes in our personal lives or large changes. And this year, I will be encouraged all of our pupils to make changes in their lives. But all of these changes will require effort and sustained force. This year, we've seen the introduction of new activities to entice students and develop a love and a new passion. All of the students will be learning new material in their subjects and studying new topics. Some may even be learning a new subject for the first time. For all of us, the new academic year presents a new opportunity to make a change, start a forward momentum, but all of this needs concerted effort. Newton's second law, the acceleration of an object depends upon the force acted upon it. Having got an object in motion, Newton's second law shows us that the acceleration and eventual speed of an object change in motion is dependent on the force acting upon it. We can therefore derive from this the rate of change and the scale of change is directly proportional to the force we apply to making this change. All of us will be able to identify the changes that we need to make in our lives. And for our youngest people, regular feedback from teachers and tutors provides us with guidance. Even for us as adults, change is important and a drive to keep trying to improve ourselves. Forward progress requires the right forces and especially the right direction. For our pupils, it's important that they apply the right force and pressure. If they want to achieve something quickly, they need to apply a forced and focused effort. Otherwise, the change will be slow. Set your goals, set your timeframes, but equally be realistic in both where you want to go and the pace of change. Setting unrealistic goals will only lead to frustration and anger. And that leads me on to Newton's third law, when two objects interact, they apply forces to each other. One of the greatest strengths of the college is the community we all live in. This community is one based on kindness, tolerance and positivity. Our daily interactions must reflect these values if we wish to maintain the community. This year, there will be innumerable interactions throughout the college community. Between staff and pupils, of course, between staff and parents, and also pupils interacting with other pupils. Each of these interactions will change the course of our lives. They are metaphorical forces that act on each of us. Through these interactions, we will apply forces that either allow us to all accelerate on our journey. If the interaction is poor, it may impede forward momentum. So while the college is renowned as a centre of learning, I hope that this year, the lesson learned is how to interact with each other in a way that applies forces of forward momentum. At times, it's too easy to be a negative force, to criticise or to push against someone. For forward momentum, we need all forces pulling in the same direction. Now, in conclusion, have a wonderful academic year and I encourage all members of the community to apply the right forces to continue to propel the college in the right direction. Have a great weekend.